Hey there kids, your Guitar Sage. Today we're going to learn how to play Let It Be by the Beatles. And I'm going to jump into it right away. I'm capoing at the 5th fret. Now, um, we don't have to play this at the 5th fret. But, for those newbies that are out there, um, it will prevent you from having to play an F chord. So I'm looking at my chart here on my screen. And I, if we have the time, I'm going to go over both parts. Um, at the fifth capo at the fifth fret and then also in the open position. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to jump into it right away, and then we'll talk about the chords. We'll talk about the construction and the different parts of the song, and possibly talk about it in another key. Okay, so here we go. I'm reading my chart, and um, it's going to go something like this. There are three basic parts to this tune, okay? Uh, we just did a verse and a chorus, and now there's a break, and it goes... Okay, now we can make it more complex. Maybe we will. We got the time, okay? Um, okay, now, let's jump into the chords and all that good stuff. Um, two, for, for you newbies, anybody who's, if you're not able to just look and see what I'm doing here and get it pretty easily, then you probably need a little supplement, and I do have such a supplement. I have an ebook at yourguitarsage.com, this little thing right here. Um, go there, get that ebook, it's really going to help you out with this. And two, um, when I'm doing these tunes and I'm shouting out the chords and stuff, you'll have access to all the chords that I do too. Um, otherwise, when I yell out the chords, you're going to have to be writing them down or just remember them. Okay? So check out yourguitarsage.com. Um, we'll help you with strumming, rhythms, how to capo, knowing when to capo, what the capo, what the heck a capo is. Um, teaches you about the national number system, all your basic open chords. Uh, it's really informative. Okay? So check that out. Okay, so here we go. If we're capoing this at the fifth fret, you're going to need to know a C, G, D, and an E minor. And I think that's it. C, G, D, E minor from what I'm looking at here. Okay. Um, okay, so here it goes. These are all split bars. Okay. And we're going to do this. There's three parts of the song. Verse, chorus, break. We're just take the verse here. It's going to go like this. It's going to go, so split bars, meaning two chords per bar or per four beats. The song's in four. So instead of, um, so it'll be like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, like that, okay? So, um, so it's going to go G, D, E minor, C, G, D, C, G. Now we could go. But um, we may talk about that. We'll, we'll, we'll do that a little bit down the line. Okay, so the verse chords are G, D, that's one measure. E minor C is another measure. G, D is another measure. And then C, G. Okay, that's the verse. Every verse that's in this song. Okay, chorus is going to go. Two in the chorus. Okay, break is gonna go like this. Okay. The first measure is C for two, G for two, 
then it's going to go D for 1, C for 1, G for 2. Okay, so if that's 1, 1, and 2, that's a measure of 4, right? Okay, um, third measure is going to go C for 2, G for 2, and then same thing we just did. D for 1, C for 1, G for 2. Okay, now, let's, um, let's talk about... Let's talk about this in another key as well. So for those of you that don't mind doing it, and for those of you that don't have a capo, I don't do this with every song, but we'll do this for this one because it's the standard, okay? But the chords for this one, we're going to have to fly on this. So again, hit yourguitarstage.com if you want to get a hold of this chart. Um, it'll show you how to do that there, and also check out that ebook. Okay, here we go. Without the capo, the chords are going to be, this is the verse, it's going to be C. Course is going to go A minor, G, F, C, C, G, F, C. Okay, now for the break. Um, for the break, it's going to go something like this. It's going to go um, F. C, G, C, F, C, G, C. Or, alternatively, if you wanted to have that walk down, you could go F, C, G, F, C, F, C, G, F, C. Okay, so. There you go. Um, that's the basic chords to this one. Um, we said that we would do that little walk down, come back up here to this other key. Um, if we now again, we're switching. We're going to pick one or the other. We're not going to do this in the middle of the song. So you got to pick one or the other, of course. Um, that little tidbit that we were talking about um, is like a if you went. Uh, let's see. C. Normally we just go C, dun, dun, dun. so there's two chords missing, and of course on the piano it's a little bit easier to do, but um, we're going to go C, and then after that you're going to hit this E minor 7, which is this right here, except we thumb that low E so it mutes out, that's our second chord, and then an A minor, and then a G. Nice little. Alright, and so that's that little change that you're hearing in there. Okay, um, now, gosh, we're running out of time here. Uh, the strumming rhythm, I would do something like, uh, let's see. Okay, so that's like a one. basic rhythm for this whole thing. Uh, for those newbies out there that can't get this strumming rhythm, you're going to go one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, four, and you see me bobbing my hand here like this. It's really important because it's going to help with your strumming rhythm. It's going to keep you in time if you're doing any sort of studio work or, well, just to keep in time with this music. So we got to keep it in time. So do, keep, make sure your wrist does that bounce there. One, two, and three, four, and three. Okay. And make sure that when you say the numbers that you're doing it down strong, at least for this particular tune. All right, kids, that's all I got for you today. We only got ten minutes to cover these tunes. So um, if you haven't already, hit subscribe so you can check out. I'm putting, trying to put a new video up every day. And um, check out yourguitarstage.com and get that ebook. It will really help. Um, hear nothing but good news from folks that are getting it. So, anyhow, check it out. Keep practicing. Go. Get out of here. Bye.